Hello and welcome to this whiskey review. We have some Scotch whiskey from obviously Scotland. This is one you bought this morning at International Market. I did. It's called yeah. Buchanan's Master. Now this company was established in 1884. Not 1984, 1884. Blended Scotch whiskey. Uh, it says Buchanan's Master is the personal selection of master blender Keith Law. Using his expertise, he has crafted a unique blend from the finest mature cask and a distinctive Buchanan's house style. Um, it's 80 proof. It's aged longer, I would assume, and uh, it's about $40 a bottle. You, you, like I said, you bought it this morning. Um, no, it's not about 40 That's what I paid for it. I, I, I looked around and I think the other places sell 45 and even higher. Oh, okay. Um, so I also looked on YouTube and there's only one other video to this and I searched intensively. Uh, so we're going to be the second review on this. Oh, I would assume they'd have a lot of videos for this. No, it's just, this is only, there's, there's only, this will be the second. And uh, the reason why I got it is it's because you spoke so highly of it. And then when I saw what appeared to be an upgrade from the base model, the, the base, Scotch, I said, well, I might as well go ahead and get it and see what's going on. So the difference between the base and this one, I think, is like $8. Yeah, the so Buchanan's 12-year age is really dynamite. The deluxe. Yeah, the deluxe. And mm -hmm. I love it. And uh, then there's this, the master, and then they there's have an 18-year age. There's one that's about $90. Yeah, those were uh, cheaper than anything. Huh? Yeah, I believe it's 80 at the store I bought this so. 80? 80? Oh, because I saw it at Walmart for 89. Mm, no, it's cheaper than Walmart. <coughs> Let's check that out. <coughs> Can you yeah, I know. get a grip so on much, that? So much for opening it before the video started. I just couldn't get a grip on it. All right. So, anyway, so it's sold extensively in Latin America, so they have this special uh, ball in here which only allows you to pour out but not in because they had a problem down there with people. I think, you have, I think you have to go back and forth. Really. Yeah, draining it out and then pouring cheap stuff in. Huh. Look at that, kids. We can't even get any liquor out of it. It'll start to flow. And once it starts to flow, it'll go berserk, you know? I don't see it going berserk. I really wish you wouldn't hold it upside down like that. Because I don't want to go berserk while you have it upside down. Well, that's the only way to get it out. Once it starts to flow, it's like even flow. All right, you can try it. So there's no age statement on this that I can see. Well, you know what? Because this is kind of annoying. <laughs> right. What the heck is going on It's here? a lot better than having somebody drain it out and put some cheap stuff in there, though. Well, maybe I should get a knife and cut this thing out. No, no, no. You can't take the ball out. Why can't I? I bought it. I can take the damn ball out. Give it to me. I'll, I'll show you. Watch. Uh, if you have the patience, if you just hold it, yeah, there you go, there you go, there you go. We well, gotta shake it. There we go. Not do what you were doing. You gotta shake it. There you go. There we go. All right. Well, it's gold. <laughs> it's gold. It smells like scotch. I've had some really good experiences with scotch, and I've had some really terrifying experiences with scotch based on horrible flavors like we won't name the brand but uh, oh baby late, scotch. one thing about Buchanan is they're kind of straightforward they're like not fancy labels it's a nice elegant bottle but they're like no hijinks with them it's like we've been putting this out since 1884 here it is and this uh, brand is from Scotland no Ireland no it's scotch it's from Scotland okay it's scotch from Japan, so I was just asking. Well, that's scotch style, you know, not scotch. It smells kind of spicy in the nose. I'm getting that penis. No smoke. I'm not picking up any smoke. Just some grains. Grain, grain whiskey and a little bread dough. It's kind of basic, but the, the taste is where it really comes into uh, where it gears up, um, you know. I'm getting some smoke, but it's really faint. Just if you study it a little bit, yeah, you're right. And going deep, you'll get some smoke. A little bit, yeah. 
But the peatiness is there. That's what you want in the scotch. You want a little the bit, yeah. Not too much, a little bit. Did you taste it already? No. Just, I'm just nosing it. Cheers, y'all. I don't know, man. This, this smells really good. It does. Ha ha ha! There's your smoked pork. <whistles> tastes like smoked. Wow. Smoked. Yeah, it tastes like smoked pork roast. Don't taste like pork to me. It tastes like really good smoked whiskey. Well, I mean, yeah, but it's I, got I, that smoke I'm approximating it. It's got that, that peatiness that you're yeah. expecting. Some good scotch. Yeah. Medium. A good highland. Medium body. I don't know about the regions, but it's a medium body and it's like um, finished. Let's see. Yeah. Uh, it's um, kind of a quick finish. I'll say moderate. Look, quick to moderate. No, it's, this is still lingering for me. Yeah? Not I, too got, I got it going all the way down. I, I, can, still, I can still taste that, that peat that's coming through. I would have to do a blind taste test between this and the uh, 12 year. I'm going to step on a limb right now and say this might be a little bit better than something you pay $250 for. Yeah, you might be a little bit wrong, but we allow people to be wrong on this channel. Anyway, it's $242. Um, notice you took a double shot of it, but uh, why nitpick? Somebody said that in the comments. Your friend took a double shot. I was like, yeah. <laughs> yeah. Your friend almost bought it, too. <laughs> that's that's kind of like buyer's privilege. Oh, you mean with the blue? Yeah. Oh. Dare Savannah discount. South of us. Go buy your bottle. All right. Uh, yeah, this is about, what, about 40 bucks a bottle. I guess at Walmart it'd be about 40 bucks. Uh, 38, 40, 42. I don't know. Once you go to Walmart and research before you can quote that price. Good good point. But something like that. Now, uh, the 18 year. I don't think you can get this at Walmart. Go ahead and see if you can get it. Because it's, it's been, to my knowledge, the only thing Walmart says is, sells is what's popular. I'm thinking this is not going to be popular. Uh, I'm talking about the Walmart in my town. I can get the Buchanan's 12 year. I can get the Buchanan's Master, and I can get the Buchanan's. Yeah, I bought it. And bought it. I can get the Buchanan's uh, uh, 18 year. No way you got the price for it. I got it. No. Well, I, I have to research it. And the Buchanan's 18 year is 89 bucks. I know that much. 89. Yeah. Get it cheaper. Well, I'm willing to shop like around. Bucks. You know, I'm not ten bucks. You know, I would drop today. 79.99. Yeah, I would. I would definitely wait to go to international market. Did you get it? 79.99. I mean, I would get a lot of things. I have too much back stock right now. You know, I have so much back stock. Mm -hmm. You know, you came to my house and you said, oh, man, you need some help. And I was like, I need help drinking it. Um, yeah, it's, I like it, but I don't know if it's, it's a little more like mellowed than the 12 year, but I love the 12 year. I love it. And that's what, that's, that's what the other, the one and only review to this, uh, I was saying I can't think of his name. Uh, that he said it was it was more mellowed. He said there was less of a bite. He said there's no bite. I'm not getting a bite from this either. No way. He said it's, it's just smooth. Uh, he he even said, uh, forgive me for not knowing your name because I only looked you up about an hour ago. Uh, but he said that uh, he said he would pay the extra money to get this over the special. Yeah, there's a, there's a little something like extra about it. More peat. I don't know, it's like an extra smoothness or delicateness to it that you can't really like enunciate, you can't really explain, but you know it's there. So yeah, pay the extra $10, you probably benefit. Now, one day, and I don't know when that day will be, it'll be a long time from now, one day I plan to buy the master and I do a bunch of taste challenges and a solo review and all. But yeah, I'm really pleased with it. I'm glad you bought it. I was kind of shocked when I looked on your table and I saw it. I said, what? So uh, that's kind of cool that you bought that's it, you know? Yep. It's good. Every now and then I treat myself to something I think is decent. How do you score it? 
I think I know my number. Ninety-eight. That's a little too high, I think. I'm gonna go with ninety-four. It, I like it. I'm not in like total adoration of it, but I, I think ninety-four is is good. Uh, why are you showing that to me? Because the cap is red. Right so you can see the special cap. Okay. He did drink a Budweiser between reviews. All right. Um. See, you got some left over there. Don't waste it. Don't waste that Budweiser. I don't remember my Budweiser. Go ahead. So anyway, <laughs> ha ha ha, ha ha ha. Anyway, yeah, um, it's it's a most excellent product. I think Buchanan's is a really dynamite blended Scotch whiskey company. I've never tasted a, a, a blend that and my tastings of Scotch just tastes like a single malt. I mean, to me, this tastes like a single malt. The uh, is, I don't know about a, that. There's a sweetness going on. Yeah, I think I, I wouldn't go along with that, but um, because the, the the blendeds have a lot more like um complexity as far as like they have like the grain whiskey, and then they have the the, the flavor from the single malt. They're sort of like more rounded, but um, but anyway, that's another argument. Um, I like both. I'm not uh, dedicated to either. So anyway, Les Les Bon Temps Relay were saying most excellent. No matter how it goes, you're saying outstanding. I, I'm not going to go that far. But thanks for buying it. Let me try it. We're going to end this review by saying, y'all come on down to Jefferson Parish, Louisiana, and drink better whiskey. <laughs> better whiskey, kids.